sees this beauty. So thin. I think it's best just to eat like this. Let me tell you guys about this truly amazing place that I found in Walton Cross. I have passed by several times, but what I didn't know is that they are halal. As the name already tells, Smoke and Barbecue is an American style place for the meat lovers. Shortly after we arrived, we were greeted by these friendly brothers who have a great sense of humor. After we were done with our order, we headed inside. The eating area is clean and nicely decorated. Since it was not busy, the food came quickly and it was well presented. I have ordered smoked pulled lamb burger, mango habanero wings and beef short ribs. Everything looked so nice and I was ready to dive into the world of American barbecue, but I needed to try the chips first. The chips were pretty decent. You can find a variety of different sauces on each table. I tried with barbecue sauce and Louisiana Cajun hot sauce. The later one was not really to my liking. The mango habanero wings had a great smoky flavor. However, I couldn't really taste much of the mango or habanero marinade. Besides that, I enjoyed them. Next was the pulled lamb burger. And oh boy, it looked truly amazing. Those pulled lamb pieces were so thin that they literally melted in my mouth. Together with the American coleslaw and gherkins, it tastes so good together. I can tell you already that this now is my favorite burger that I have had so far. It is a masterpiece. And when you think it can't get any better, comes the beef short ribs. I have no idea who came up with the name, but this rib is not short for sure. I started with the fatty part, which of course melted in my mouth. And I don't think I have ever tasted any meat as good as this. Am I in heaven? <laughs> I continued with the meaty part, which I sandwiched together with the fat. When I took the bite, I could feel all the different textures, the buttery soft fat, the tender meat and the crispy charred part. What a taste! I tried to eat it also together with the American mustard, which is a pretty good combination. The best part of the ribs in my opinion, is usually the meat that's closest to the bone. And I was not wrong. I could have finished it all, but I needed to share with my camera woman. I will give this place 9 out of 10. They really deserve it. I don't know what kind of magic you are doing there. But I never had anything like this. Thank you so much. Just to cook it, it takes 10 to 12 hours wow. to smoke mm -hmm. it. So, and there is time before to prepare it and all of this. Mm -hmm. So everything patient yeah. comes in the end. Anything you cook in a rush, yeah. not really tasty. Before we went off, we also checked their butcher store. Everything that you can buy there, you can also ask the boys to grill for you. That includes the 5-star Japanese Wagyu, which cost 190 pounds per kilogram. Maybe when I become famous I will come back for it. Mm -hmm.